side piece is glued up now. I'm gonna let that dry up for a while and then take it from there. For the bottom, this is just a piece of old, maybe 3 16 ply or something like that. I think it's old. It came off an old shelf or something that I found. And I just, it got to raining on it out there and I had to squeeze up in this shed real quick. So I just grabbed that and cut it down before it came in here. Some of these pallet boards are fit up a little funny. I didn't do a whole lot to smooth them. I didn't do any kind of plane in or anything like that. I just smoothed them enough. The insides and stuff anyway to, you know, to get a, a decent fit up. It's just a birdhouse, so. But it still needs to stay together.
All right, I finished this birdhouse up, and it came out looking pretty good. It's all pallet wood. There's a couple different kinds of wood. You can hear these chickens back here hollering. Everything came out looking pretty good. It's got these plants. These, I think they're vincas or something. These plants can be changed. If you want to change them, whoever gets it. And on the top, I put an eye hook on each side. And it'll just hang up like that off this little S hook. Also, when I, I don't think I showed that on the video, but I put this little perch in there. Uh, I put a coat of polyurethane on it just to kind of add a little weather protection to it. That pallet wood, I mean, it lasts in the weather quite a while anyway. And, uh, but a little polyurethane just to help it out. And you've seen I put that oil on. I just put the oil to try to bring out the colors a little more. Everything came out looking pretty good. But, uh, so I guess that'll wrap that one up. Also, I went ahead and done this one too. And this one, I, I'm trying to do an aged kind of look to it. I painted it white and then painted some brown over it and then sanded a lot of that off of there and then put some of this uh, decorative glaze on there. It's supposed to make it look aged. It works sometimes depending on the color you got. And a plant will go on the side of there and I, I'm just letting it dry up right now. But it came out pretty good. That's just plywood, some old cheap plywood. It's off. It came off of a pallet, but I just, I didn't want to leave it as just plywood. So anyway, I guess that'll do it. If uh, if you like these type of videos, man, I don't usually, I mean, I'm not building a lot of birdhouses around here. I'm doing them now because of, uh, I'm still doing the farmer's market in Bozer, and I'm just trying to get some more stuff for it, and I'm thinking something like that will probably sell pretty good. But, uh, and I'm still waiting to get steel on that barbecue pit. I know y'all waiting on part two for that, and I'm going to get it done. It's just... This is kind of what I'm doing, little oddball stuff until I get the steel for it. But uh, if you like these type of videos, please come back and subscribe. And uh, we're going to have some more welding videos, more woodworking videos. And uh, we'll see you on.